determine the convergence of the given series, the sum n equals one, n equals one to infinity of n minus one over two n plus one. So take this series for a moment, pause this video if necessary, and consider which convergence test might you use on this series to determine whether it's convergent or divergent. Now for me personally, what I'm thinking is something like the following. I have a rational expression here for the sequence, n minus one over two n minus one. If I focus, if I focus just on the leading terms, I have this n over two n, n over two n, this sequence is approximately the same thing to that, which looks like one half. So a comparison of some kind might be useful uh, because of the plus one on the bottom and the minus one on the top, uh, a direct comparison test would be very difficult. A limit comparison test is also possible, but even better yet, when you look at this sequence, this is supposed to be approximately equal to one half. The, actually, the test of divergence comes to my mind right here. Consider the sequence uh, n minus one over two n plus one. If we take the limit as n goes to infinity, again, because this is a balanced rational function, this thing will convert, this will be the same limit as n over two n. You could also use L'Hopital's rule here, but that's kind of overkill. Uh, this is gonna become just one half. And so this, in, in terms of thinking of the comparison test, I actually then identify that, hey, this thing is not gonna converge to zero the limit of the sequence is not zero, and therefore this series is going to be divergent. It's divergent, and what are we using here? We're using the divergence test. And so I think that's perhaps the simplest way to determine the divergence of this series here, but uh, using the divergence test. But as we mentioned before, you might be wanted to use a limit comparison test because at the beginning it kind of looked like that. And that's in the thought process that got me thinking about the limit comparison test ultimately led to me thinking it was divergence by the divergence test.